Hello there, everybody. How is it going today? My name is Kev Bottomy, and I am back with another Minecraft cute statues video. So, if you didn't see it already, I recently uploaded a new video where I do a tour of a bunch of my different worlds, this world included, and as part of that tour, I decided to do a little bit of something new at the end, and that was to sort of go through some of the building procedures for the cute statues. So I kind of went through it, showed you how I work out the shapes and stuff for the statue. However, it wasn't really a complete tutorial or anything on how to design these statues, and I also mentioned that I wanted to possibly introduce that as a new segment to the to the series. So, with that said, I would like to give that a try today. So what we're going to do is we're going to pick up where we left off at the end of the world tours and I'm going to take the statue that I started to show you and we're going to turn it into a finished project. So, what we've got in front of me, I guess technically, and now it's behind me. So we've got this cute little start of a lion statue. Now, it's not that bad. There's some good elements to it. There's some bad elements to it, but I'm definitely not happy with it yet. So. What I'm going to do at the start of this video is go over some changes, and then, yeah, we'll test out this new segment, and then I will do the time lapse, and then I'll show you how to build it. After that, well, you'll just have to wait for another video. So, without further ado, let's get started. Alright guys, so, first and foremost, we're going to kind of just take a look at this guy. Now, there's, okay, so the big thing I'm not happy with is the face. So for, this face looks scrunched down. I think I have to make it a block taller. So I'm going to play around with that for a bit. Now, other than that, I'm actually quite happy with the rest of the statue. So the mane looks good. I like the way the ears superimposed on the different color mane looks. So... There might not be too many changes we have to make. I think the body looks okay. I think the shape of the mane is great. So what we're going to do is try to play around a little bit. So first, let's just see what it looks like. If we add some blocks and just kind of fill out the face. We have the eyes sort of in the center, the nose down towards the bottom, and... Uh, it kind of looks weird, but maybe better. I'm also curious to see what it looks like, like that, or like that. No, absolutely not. So I think it's kind of got to be either that or that. Now, this is where the difficult part of building these statues comes in. So because of the scale that I'm working at, you know, the entire body is only three blocks wide. We get one block per leg. And it makes it a little bit difficult to properly design an animal head that looks good with the rest of the scale. So that's kind of the hard part here. Now, luckily, scale between different builds isn't a huge issue. For example, a lion is much bigger than a parrot. However, I am building the statues the same size, so... I don't know. I think I like this the best with the three high head, but I'm not sure yet. And I don't want to sit here on camera just sort of fumbling around for too long, but I don't really have much else for ideas on how to improve it. I'm pretty sure that that looks quite a bit better than the two high head and so I'm probably gonna stick with that 
we've still got our good main shape and I, uh, it looks too much like the polar bear that's what's getting to me hmm I'm gonna take a break quick and see if I can find any more inspiration on how to make this look a little better Honestly, it's not that bad, though. This might be the iteration I go with. I'll catch you in a minute. Alright, so I thought I would give the four-eyed cat a try. <laughs> I mean, I'm kidding. I was going to actually try moving the eyes upwards to see what that looked like, and that's kind of absolute garbage, so definitely not happy with that. Uh, I guess maybe I'll try playing around with different nose options, see if that makes a difference, because, I mean, cats have cute little boopy noses, so maybe it's not unrealistic to keep the face white and try maybe a mob head or something instead. So I'm going to get all of that placed in, and we'll see what that looks like. <laughs> It's like a dog lion. Look at it. it <laughs> okay, that is ridiculous and not correct. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to go with my original idea here. Uh, one moment. Alright, guys. Well, I mean, I'm happier with the face than I was before. I don't think it looks that bad. I think the statue is pretty cute at this point. The mane really helps it out. So... I'm going to call it there. I think that's a good improvement. And now we're going to maybe play around with the blocks we're going to build this out of real quick. And then we're going to get into a tutorial. So as far as blocks to build this with goes, I mean, I think the white and pink is really cute. However, to be a little bit more realistic, we should do something like a tan and a brown or something like that so well let's see what we can find here do 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 that that might be okay the yellow terracotta yellow terracotta might not be too bad or sandstone I'm not totally sure yet um actually the sand might not be too bad um we're going to try we're gonna try yellow terracotta and we're gonna try brown terracotta unless mm, brown concrete looks a little lighter so we're gonna try that instead so if we replace all of the white with all of the yellow terracotta all of the pink with the brown terracotta we should have a little bit more of a real looking lion statue and we're gonna see what that looks like Alright guys, well, I cannot decide. I mean, proportionally, I think that looks better without the extra head and extra stuff, but also with the extra head, it... I think that looks pretty okay too, so let me know down below which of the two statues you prefer? Do you prefer the three high head that I'm showing right here? Or would you rather that I take out these blocks and lower the ears and show it like that? Uh, one looks a little more realistic. I think the other looks cute. I think the I think the three by three head looks a little bit more adorable. However, it's also a little bit um, less realistic. I'm, I'm not sure. So this gives me a chance to ask you guys what you think of either option. Honestly, in this, this way, I like that guy a little bit better, but it, it's so hard. I don't know. You guys let me know down below and I'll make a decision based off what you guys think. But for now, let's get on to the tutorial.
Actually, no. We're not going to get on the tutorial. We're going to get on the biome time lapse. And then the tutorial. Still getting used to this. Well, I think for the sake of the rest of the video, I'm going to go with my original option for the lion statue. So, the head's a bit squished, but ultimately I think it does match the best. So, I'm going to go with that. If you think otherwise, let me know down below. And I may do a revision in the future if it's necessary, but for now, this will do, and let's get on to the time lapse.
Alright guys, so now that our cute lion statue has its own home and I have I've reverted back to this head once again. So now we're going to go all the way down to the end here and do the tutorial quick. So we want to start off with a 5x6 area like this. We want to come in one from the back and we want to place down the feet in a little 3x3 three three like that. And we want to build up a too high body on top of all of that. Now while we're at the back end here we can add the tail going up so that'll just be two blocks and then a dark brown on the end there. Then we want to come over to one side and on this corner we want to build a little 2x2 two two area of the dark brown there. We want to have it come across the middle back like so and then up one block like that. We want to bring it all the way across and repeat on the other side. Now we want to bring it across the front like that and we also want to bring that up like like so. And then we just bring that across and we are done with the main. Now we can bring our blocks and fill it all in. We can bring the face one more forward so we're in line with our area. And then of course the ears go at the back. It would seem like I made this the wrong size. So with the eyes as well, we're going to need it to be 5 by 7. So I apologize for that mistake. So we're just going to drop a block there, do the paintings for eyes, and we want a mouth right there. Maybe we could use the dark brown, but I prefer the black myself. Kind of gives it a little snout looking area. So. We spam our paintings and that will be the last step done for our cute lion statue. So guys, that's about all I've got for you today. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button and be sure to let me know down in the comments section below what you thought of the new intro segment where I play around with building the statue and short of, short of sort of show you the design process. So if you enjoyed that little bit, let me know down below. I quite had some fun with it, so I might keep doing it. We'll see. And with that said, I would like to see you guys in the next video. So if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe, hit that bell icon to receive notifications, and I will catch you in the next video.